You should know it's okay to have different feelings. Recognize that. It's normal to feel sad, angry, exhausted, frustrated, confused. And how does that have to do with effectively communicating with your ex-spouse? I'm sure that's what you're wondering. But all of these feelings can be so intense and you're feeling anxious about the future. So we need to accept these reactions. They will lessen over time. Even if the marriage was unhealthy, venturing into the unknown is really a frightening situation. It's really scary. Give yourself a break. Pat your yourself on the back. These give yourself permission to feel and function a little less than optimal. You might not be able to be quite as productive on a job or care for others in the exact way that you are accustomed to. No one is Superman or Superwoman. Take time. You need to heal and regroup. Re-energize. Please don't go through this alone. Share your feelings with a friend or a family that will help you get through this period. You may even consider joining a support group where you would talk to others in the same situation. Don't isolate yourself. We want to reduce Reduce your stress. We want to focus on concentrating and getting your work done appropriately. Relationships and overall health are really a big part of our life. Don't be afraid to get help from the outside. Also, you're welcome to talk to a high conflict coach like myself. Take care of yourself emotionally and physically. Be good to yourself, your body. Make sure you're relaxing, but also try to keep that normal routine as possible. 